Okay, so I didn't expect that the uh, that uh, this would happen today. The uh, that the railroad. I thought I was a couple of days away from completion, actually, because the um, the last piece of track that I was putting in was the most difficult. It had to be cut precisely the right way, or it wouldn't work. So that's why I bought the flex track to give me a couple of tries at it. Um, however, today is a momentous day for me because I think I started this project in November of 2021. And I got up this morning and I had no idea that, that today would be the day of when I would be able to complete the track. Because I've been thinking about how am I going to get that last piece of track in. However, I want to share something with everybody right now because this just happened about 20 minutes ago and uh, I was able to get the piece of track in without using the flex track and I got my Santa Fe running today, one of my Santa Fe engines. So here goes. Let me bring it back for you. I always, I always started from right here. And for Anthony, I will really try, Anthony, to keep the camera uh, moving slower. So what we're going to do is just, just going to follow the Santa Fe. And that's my favorite engine of all time. Anything that's got Santa Fe coloring on it, I, I want. Because that's just, that's my favorite engine. I'm trying to go slow. Um, the chickens are in the backyard. I'll take a picture of them in a minute. Now, we're getting to the point where it comes around the loop. It comes down the slope. There's the joiner track. And it went over it as smooth as could be. It's on the lower level now. It's on the lower level. And this was like a bonus for me because I never thought that it was going to be finished today. 